The CEO of Huntsville Hospital says that they have been doing coronavirus testing outreach in some churches in North Huntsville, as well as some homeless shelters. Just this week, they went to the Northwoods Community and Dr. Richard Showers Center for additional testing. Way 31's Will Robinson Smith is there live tonight. He spoke with church and state leaders about how this testing came about and why it was so important. Will. Well, Huntsville Hospital CEO David Spiller says they're still waiting on some of the test results for the folks that were tested here at the Dr. Richard Showers Center. But folks I spoke with say that they're just glad that the hospital and the state and the city are prioritizing testing outside of some of the normal areas. Hallelujah. The Sanctuary of Fellowship of Faith Baptist Church rang with gospel music Wednesday night. A handful of people dotted the seats while others watched the Bible study online. But a few weeks ago, this church was offering another kind of service. So once we made the announcement that we were having tests, the phones just readily started ringing and we filled up real quick. Near the end of last month, Huntsville Hospital selected this and four other churches as sites for testing hundreds of people. Pastor Troy Gardner says having local testing helps people know there is a lot more work to do before things get back to normal. We have to tell people to be prayerful and careful. Yes, you want the economy to be started again, but you also want to save lives as well. And I think saving lives is more important than saving the economy at this time. Alabama House Minority Leader Anthony Daniels says he and others helped coordinate the North Huntsville effort. He says being able to test at-risk communities is key to moving closer to reopening the economy. Individuals that are having those symptoms are uh, really more of a priority in, in getting those test results so that they are not uh, adding to the community spread of the virus. Blue Spring Road Church of Christ was also a testing center. Pastor Floyd Rogers was among the 70 who were tested. There were people that actually rode by that saw that they were here, turned around, and came back around to get tested. So yes, it's very important just for them to come into the communities, the different communities, and offer this service. We thank them. And David Spiller says the next stop for their community testing is going to be the Trianic community. They're expecting to do that this Friday. Reporting live in Huntsville, Will Robinson Smith, Way 31 News.